Hello, you're watching Age of Mobiles. Today I want to show you the difference between the Genin digitizer touch screen for Nokia 5530 and between the uh, high copy replica. So uh, why I call it really high copy? Because uh, in uh, the official services of Nokia, uh, when these parts were not available, they were uh, ordering these kind of stuff. So. Uh, this is considered to be really the best use. So, uh, first of all, we see as a difference, uh, you can see here that uh, no logo of Nokia. It is, but you see it's just hidden by the foil, by the black foil. And it is also uh, a kind of um, quality star, as uh, if you see the item where the logo is closed uh, so you can be sure that this is a kind of good stuff uh, so yeah the difference in here is uh, you see the protection foil is here just on the center side where a part of the sides where the front cover comes and here is put it up to up to side foil i even don't know how to take it away so now let's turn it so you see that the genuine is just one part. It is a digitizer touch screen here. Uh, the copy one comes with a uh, uh, touch screen frame. Uh, yeah, original Nokia comes uh, apart. But sometimes, sometimes you can face these two parts together. They will be genuine, but this is really rare to see them only just in some, after some services. As actually they were separate, this and this one separate. So, uh, you also see, uh, when you look at the flex. So, big IST here is a big difference, yeah? In this flex. This part. So, also see how to. Let's compare it now. So, they are. They were. This is the difference between uh, the genuine and the replica digitizer for Nokia 5530.